The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE United States Championship! The animal has been unleashed. Not a man you ever want to underestimate when it comes to his in-ring prowess. Yeah, don't underestimate a specimen like him when it comes to anything, because he can powerbomb you in the next week. Six foot six, 295 pounds, all animal. We've seen that when the beast is unleashed, nobody can stop Batista. Championships, main events, Batista will take them by force. And gentlemen, tonight the animal is on the hunt for even more. Double champ in the building. Skills so nice, they call him champ twice. One man, two championships, and the talk of an entire industry. You have got to respect the fact that this is what greatness looks like. The significance of this accomplishment cannot be overstated. He has solidified his legacy by carrying those two championships. He went through adversity, survived the wars, and in the end, there could only be one winner. And that winner holds two titles. He's looking pretty unshakable entering the ring. Yeah, and whether he is or not, just appearing that way to your challenger is what it takes. And the champion knows that. The challenger from Washington, D.C., weighing in at 290 pounds, the animal Batista! And his opponent from Sacramento, California, weighing in at 205 pounds, the WWE United States Champion, and the world heavyweight champion, the world's most dangerous man, Ken Shamrock! Forty-five years of history behind that, the United States Championship.
This is all for the right to call yourself the United States. Has the challenger pinned? Is this it? And the champ only gets a count of one. Channeling his energy to stay in this matchup. Yikes. Ripcord. Oh my goodness, nasty line. Shamrock, getting ready. Brought down with a DDT. Planning on what to do next. Oh, tossed aside. Cover by the challenger. The champ avoiding a one count. He is definitely struggling to keep him down at this point. Had that one scouted. Hurricane Rana. Unbelievable athleticism. That kind of agility is what earned them the title. DDT plants them. Taking it outside the ring now. It's easy to see why Batista has been one of the most feared superstars in all of WWE. What do you have to do to overcome that fear and take down this big man, Corey? Simply put, Cole, be quick and be accurate. You're not going to take down a Redwood like Batista with one giant swing of your axe. You need to chip away until the animal falls. That was all power. Taking it to the champ with incredible force. Throwing down punches and counters out. Unbelievable athleticism. It's incredible the inventiveness we are seeing on display here. Fans off the attack with an elbow. What are you guys thinking? Obviously not about the ref's count, Cole. He steps foot in the ring again. He's back in so close to a count out. You do not want to lose that way. Ouch. Shamrock turns it around. Fireman's carry. Nice takedown. Break in the face. My God. Look at this heel hook. This is how you punish your opponent, and he's enjoying every minute of it. Batista's being picked apart here. You can tell he did his homework here. Just chopping away at Batista with aptitude. Quick and accurate. And gets suplexed instead. Shoulder tackle. Dominating shoulder tackle. the hammer right on the lower back the challenger not looking good right now and hanging tough but beginning to show some wear and tear might want to think about picking up the pace a bit has the leg trapped fisherman suplex goes into the pin only a one count before the kick out showing his determination there with that kick out Man, can't quite get him there. There by Batista. Batista taking care of business and loving every second of it. Batista is surely getting what he wants right now. Pulls their opponent in. Belly to belly. Batista's looking sluggish. Things could be winding down for him. And Shamrock picks the leg, looking for the ankle lock submission. It's cinched in. The official asking him is, this is a tough submission to be in, but he found his way out. Oh, man. Knee straight to the gut, stays off the attack. Ooh, DDT. And now Shamrock is stalking. And Shamrock picks the leg, looking for the ankle lock submission. It's cinched in. I think he's got it locked in good. I just don't. Ken Shamrock retains the title. Here is your winner. And still, WWE United States Champion, the world's 
most dangerous man, Ken Shamrock. And he has to be satisfied with himself defending the championship like he did. He just cemented his title reign with a gutsy performance.